Okay guys, so here I am. I'm at Ball Horticultural in West Chicago. I'm getting ready to go inside and tour their seed lab. It's the biggest one in North America of its kind. I am just super excited that we're going to get a behind the scenes tour. Let's go inside and check it out. All right, so Jerry, where are we right now? Well, we are in the seed vault and the seed vault is where the seed is stored. And the particular one we're in today is when it first comes in from the production farms, it will come in a cloth bags like this. And the importance about the cloth bags is that the seed can breathe in the different air environments and humidity environments that it's in. So the cloth bag will help it ripen, help it finish maturing, help it come out of its dormancy. And then we can start processing the seed, whether it be taking the tails off or pelleting it or coating it or whatever we need to do. But this is how it comes into our facility before anything else happens. So there's not just uh, the air moving in and out of here. It's, there's just a lot more to it than just that. There is a lot more to it in there. There's a certain amount of curing that has to happen on the seed before we can process it. How about that? There's an active process taking place inside of here. Yep. So right now, it, this is it. How, uh, about how cold is it in here right now? Right now, it's about 40, 42 degrees okay. Fahrenheit. Uh, how humid? Do you keep this place usually? The humidity is right around 25 to 30 percent relative humidity. Very good. So we were talking before about what's a good equation for storing storing seed in terms right. of temperature. And so for for homeowners, if they're going to store seed themselves, I think their relative humidity and their temperature in Fahrenheit should not be over 100. Okay. So 60 degrees Fahrenheit. 40 degree, 40% 40 humidity, you're still in the clear. Exactly. Okay. And I will say too that if they are carrying seed over at home, they can put it in a Tupperware container with some rice, some dried rice in the bottom of okay. it, and that will help take the moisture out of the container itself, and then refrigeration will help keep the colder temperature. They can keep seed longer. Very, very good. Oh, well, that's very interesting to know. Thank you, Jerry. Okay, thank you.